Uh, you are all awake? So, I thought and I talk about high school, okay? It was a bit different for me on my first day of high school. I remember it like it was 28 days ago. <laughs> Oh, what happened was all of us great times in my school who oh, were all cowardly in a crowd so we'd be safe hey, from the 12th and 11th graders. The thing is, we were watching too many TV shows about high school oh, that we think it's like hey, they will attack us if we're alone <laughs> and give us whirlies and wedgies. <laughs> Now for me, I was the person that always was the, on the outside, so it was different for me. He, when I went to high school, I asked one of the uh, kids, one of the twelves, when are we having recess? Then he said to me, we don't have recess in high school. My reaction was, what? No recess? How am I supposed to burn off all the energy I have without recess? And I don't have gym this semester. <laughs> so, what happened to me was when in class I was sitting in my desk waiting for the bell to ring. Unfortunately, no waiting for no recess. I start having this quiver in my leg right here, right now. think of was, I'm sweating, I'm, my leg is shaking, I need to get rid of this energy. So what I do is I ask the teacher if I could go to the washroom. So I he went to the washroom, I he went into one of the stalls. I was thinking, get rid of the energy, get rid of the energy. So all I could do was look down at the toilet and do this. you up. <laughs> but when I did it, I made sure that nobody else was there, because if uh, someone hear me scream, they would scream, <laughs> then that would he, then it would be heard by someone else freaking them out, someone will hear them freaking out, so they will freak out, and so on and so on and so on and so on. <laughs> So on. <laughs> In kindergarten, it was great. Am I right? Yeah. I mean, we got long recess, nap time, and all the paste you could eat. <laughs> <laughs> and when it was ha how we started eating paste, I don't know, but it's a story that goes like this. We were finger painting, and one of us needed to ask it for a towel to wipe our hands when we were done, and the teacher wasn't around, and the uh, towels were gone, and the paste was non toxic so... <laughs> Ain't half bad. <laughs> then, and when recess came, hey man, it was incredible. We had big, we had football, Red Rover, yeah. Four Square, and one sport that, that was very popular Kiss Tag. Yeah! Yeah! <laughs> I mean, when Happened when Kiss Tag was on. All we, the most of the guys were, were not it, so all the girls were it. So all we could think of was, oh no, I don't want to get it. No. <laughs> and when the bell always rings, the kids freak out about it. They run out the door. One kid. It brings a can of blue paint with them, dips their finger in it, takes a little lick, 
then they put it on half their face and yell, Fredo! <laughs> then, and went back to Red Rover, okay? And we hold our, ourselves in a chain, and someone runs past us, and, and boom, we dislocate our shoulder, <laughs> and then we say, now what am I supposed to do with this thing? I guess I'm a lefty now. <laughs> now then, I'm just going back to high school, okay? And now people say that dodgeball was the best sport in gym. And it still is, even in high school. Back in elementary school, it was a game of fun. And where you just have to get by as fast as long as you can. But in high school, it's a game of survival! There are kids that throw balls so fast and powerful it could not, it will hurt that if it hurts you in the groin, it's pain beyond pain. <laughs> Just like every high school newbie, I he got lost. So I asked a 12th grader for directions. I ask him, him, and he towers over me. I'm scared, and the first thing he says to me is, Hey, it's a Frodo! <laughs> then all I could find was fun! <laughs> then once I ran the other direction, he said to me, Frodo! Frodo, where are you going? You forgot your ring. <laughs> Go look at Mordor then. <laughs> and then, and when, it, and went back to recess, okay? Hey, I sort of forgot a few parts in it. <laughs> but when we, he go back, when the bell rings for recess is over, we, he, all the kids freak out again. And then all the kindergartners try and get in a straight line as possible. One kid says, we need to make a straight line, okay? He, Jack and Jill, just went up the hill, and I want to know what happens next. <laughs> and then when and we get inside, one, a few kids get in line at the water fountain, and, and they take, uh, and one person always takes a drink first, and, and they always forget to breathe through their nose, okay? And so it's like this. Blood, 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 blood. <laughs> I mean, if you do that, you should have a bench next to the water fountain for you to lay down. I mean, breathing is the first lesson you learn when you are born. Everybody knows how to breathe. Okay? And when? And back to high school again. And some people say that they always have a favorite memory of theirs in high school. Some say it's their yearbook. Others, it's a picture of them on their favorite field trip in high school. Some, it's their math textbook. <laughs> I say about that, they show up in outside more. <laughs> Some people like to keep items from for their favorite events and slide their tickets from a concert or a sports game. Now most people would keep theirs because it was, it was their first event and they really loved it, but most guys would say there was a coupon on the back of it. <laughs> Thank you everybody. You've been